Hey everybody, Stan Evasion, back with another break. Got a couple of cool hockey boxes here. I got a 22-23 SPX box and a 21-22 Premier hockey box. Kind of a higher end rip. I do like both of these products, although this one, not as much as this one. Uh, again, last year's SPX really put me off. Over the years, I've, I've enjoyed SPX. Actually, going back to 15-16, I pulled a McDavid Jersey Auto out of SPX, and that was an incredibly tough thing to do, as they were a really tough pull in 15, 16, but um, 21, 22 Premier has been fairly good to me. I've opened up, this will be no, box number five, and um, I'm really anxious to see how this one goes as I've done pretty good up till now, but um, we'll see what's in this one. Uh, SPX, again, I just thought this is such a small, short video to put it in all alone. Uh, it, you know, you need something to go with it. So why not another short, quick rip and we'll put the two together. Actually, this is a fairly expensive rip, so if you do like this kind of video, please tap the like button and subscribe. Consider it at least. Have a thought. It's free. I'm giving away free subscriptions. Um, actually, so does everybody. But every subscription helps. Everybody that joins the channel really does support it and, and makes me strong. Feeling, uh, it makes me feel good inside. Anyway, um, I don't know what that serial number might mean, but you never know. You might need it because sometimes these boxes are not exactly what you're supposed to get, which still waiting on upper deck to make good on some of the cards that I didn't get in some of the packs that were short cards. It says five, sometimes you get four. I'm fully prepared to be let down. Um, but so far, Premier was, let's just not think of the negative and hopefully, oops, give you the info you might need. Um, yeah, SPX is actually two products in one. It's black and SPX. And I've finally seen a black autographed card. I prefer them as they are hard signed cards. Well, whereas the, uh, you know what, let's just rip both boxes. While I'm in that mode, I put my knife sharp object back in its safe spot. Away from me. Premier. Okay, yeah, and there's a ton of different stuff in Premier. More hard signed content in Premier, but there is the odd sticker that has slipped in there. And Zegris and Cider mainly. They didn't, uh, while well, they were holding out or non unavailable for their autograph at the time. But anyway, yeah, here we go. Premier SPX. Hope everybody's had a great hockey season so far. I'm actually ripping this right before Upper Deck Series 1 comes out. I'm so excited. I can't wait. I mean, it, it shouldn't be. There are things in life that are more important than hockey cards. But right now, there isn't. It's the most important thing. Series 1 coming out. A whole batch of young guns, a new format. Anyway, here's SPX from last year. 2223 SPX. 203 of 299 base card. Ollie Lixell. I've never seen this guy before. I don't know how much 2223 I opened. Obviously, not nearly as much as 2122, but who the heck is it's a rookie? I now see at the bottom rookies. Base card rookie of Ollie Lixell. Okay, well, let's see how I can uh, look at the side. What's this? Whoops. What's this on the side? Got a little ride along on the edge of the card. There is something black and thick in the middle. Maybe that's a good sign. Okay, well, all elixir. I've already seen the back. J Rob, a blue radiance FX parallel. Blue is the first level. I think it's 549 for the regular. And then there's a red and a gold and a purple and a black and a green. And no, I don't know. I think there's just blue, red. Gold and black. I, I again have to review my notes. Something's peeking through here. Looks like one of them grand finales. Perhaps it's just a radiance. Let's have a look. I got a radiance parallel of Jack LaFontaine. I believe that's a rookie. No, I'm curious, sister. Jack LaFontaine from Mississauga. Hey, I know that area fairly well. I lived in Clarkson way back in the day. There's the numbering. I had a hard time seeing it. Still having a hard time. 95 of 100. And I believe, that again, that's Radiance, not Grand Finale. Okay, all elixir. What are you hiding? There's a card there, and it is another Radiance. FX. Dale Howarchuk. Hall of Fame. Rest in peace. Captain of the old Winnipeg Jets. Now Coyotes, but uh, cool. And, okay, this is a black. I think it's a lustrous black. Might just be a jersey. No, it'd be an autograph. If all goes according to plan here. Which way is it? 
black. Obsidian. Mark Stalic. Cool. Hard signed card, number 55 of 125. Patch Auto, I guess, uh, more appropriately called. RPA. Mark Stalic. That's cool, but again, I keep uh, with this product familiar in my mind. These surfaces, that upper deck, I don't know how you can make a card like that without getting it. Look at it. It's got like stuff all over it. Can you not maybe figure out a way of making that not happen? I'm always so critical when I pull a nice card because I want it to be just right. Mark Costellic. Well, there you go. Centerman for the, I think he's what, third line? But Room to Grow, born in 1999, last century. Right on. I like it. It's my second black auto rookie card. The first one was not with this little nice piece in the middle. Definitely like that one. Here we go. Time warp. Definitely the best bowl there, but we'll see what time does to Mark Castellic in his career. Sen's got a lot of young talent. Okay, here we go. Premiere. Then we go. All right, let's finish this with a bang. Again, I've enjoyed my premiere ripping so far. This is uh, the third pack out of the uh, of a fresh case where I've seen two packs come out of already, or boxes. It's ten boxes in a mini case, and uh, whatever. Let's just get at it. That's that's just irrelevant data there, but. Starting off with Brendan Gallagher base card for the Montreal Canadiens. Card number, is that 66 of 299? I'm really having a hard time reading the 68 of 299. Right on. Okay. Brendan Gallagher starting us off. What's behind Brendan Gallagher we got? I don't want to reveal too early. Quentin Byfield, premier retro collection jersey from 2001-2002. The OG design. Wait, wait. Okay, it's officially been opened. Just worn. Just not game worn. Okay, well. Next card being. Well, hello. Update. 2001. Tyler Benson. Nice patch there. Oilers with all that going on in there. I really do like that for uh, quality in the patch. And Tyler Benson. Oilers. Okay, well, how's that going to be beaten? With an Igor Sokolov gold rookie autograph. And why not? I've been pulling Sokolov cards here, there, and everywhere. Actually, it was in a one group break I joined on uh, release day. <laughs> I got two Sokolov RPAs coming in there, too. And I think I've already pulled one myself. So let's just corner the market on Sokolovs. Okay. I haven't looked at the back of any of these yet. I'll do that afterwards. One card to go. Am I short a card again? I am. Well, let's get all the sock loss. I called it. There it is. Two more. Sock loss, sock loss, sock loss, sock loss. 49 of 49. The ultimate RPA patch of Igor Sokolov. And I, I must have every Sokolov out of this product at this point. There's probably a 101 I'll never have. But Well, cool. Although not cool. Missing a card again, upper deck. How many times? How many times? How many packs? How many products are you going to do this to? Six premium cards per pack. Well. Upper deck, I should just phone them up. James and Jason, I've got them on the first name basis. I spoke with Trevor now. Holy cow, guys. Do you want to see this video too? Because you asked to see my last ones. Five. One, two, three, four, five. Count them. I'm short a card again. I'm not too upset because I do. Ha I'm happy with what I saw, but upper deck can't count. Please. Well, at least I got an audience to bear the pain with me. You guys have seen it happen as it's happened. I want my cards. Well, again, thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging in there and putting up with my little venting there. I, I, again, I shouldn't be too upset. There's worse problems to have. But come on, guys. And I don't know. Is it just me? Is everybody finding the same thing? Are you guys getting shorted cards? Every premium product I've opened up for Upper Deck this year has been missing.
cards. A card, sometimes it's the autograph, sometimes it's not, but SPX, Ultimate, Premier, even Stature, although I didn't make a big scene out of it because it happened then, but uh, Black Diamond, I mean, it goes on and on and on. I don't even feel like sleeving the rest now. I mean, Sock Clock deserves a little love. But I hate writing these letters. Okay, well, on that note, hope everybody else is having a great day. I, again, I'm, I'm just dealing with problems in the industry. And who isn't at this point? Thanks for uh, watching. Keep on collecting, everybody. Standing ovation out.